The power is real good. I was able to push heavy wind rows and have great steering. Wasn't having to fight the machine. Moving big wind rows, no problem at all. The gear select was, was great. The new shifter controls going from forward to reverse, going up and down the gears is very ergonomic. This one, it's push of a button. It's easy to pick what gear you want to go in. I was able to put the blade in as far as the ground as I wanted to without the engine or the uh, hydraulic stalling at all. Implement power is great. Doing grading in third gear forward, the machine is faster, carrying a lot of material and turns your cycle times down in high idle 3F. The machine would turn around and multifunction with the levers doing the articulation, rotating the blade back to the other side to keep casting the the wind roll over, carry good speed, and cover a lot of ground quickly. So I actually did travel back to the yard from the test site at uh, eighth gear full run out, and I believe I hit 52 kph, and yeah, it was awesome. Running the machine in eco mode saves fuel, which slows down your refuel times or extends that duration. If you own the machine and you're paying for the fuel, you're gonna wanna use it. We were doing heavy grading, building a 3% crown, and this machine was able to carry a consistent grade using the cross slope meter. It was very accurate and precise to build the grade. Ripping with this machine with five shanks down in first gear with the additional power, you can rip through very hard ground, turn the diff lock on and be able to eat through it. I was using the, the compression brake and I, I tried it with on and off and it, it definitely works. It'll slow you down on grade. We're traveling 20 to 15% down grade and the compression brake works well, seventh gear. Visibility is very important while you're operating the machine. Operating this machine, I can see everything I need to and operate very safely. Blade, I was able to sink the blade. We were doing V-ditches. We are carrying what, 18 inches easily. We're running a motor grader with the LED equipped lights. The day and night comparison running uh, with a halogen to a LED. Visibility is great. You can see exactly what you're doing and be precise at your grading. The rear camera is awesome. If you're backing up into a tight space, backing up into the shop or other personnel or equipment, you can see exactly what's behind you. Resolution is great. It's very defined. But the ergonomics were good. I learned how to operate a motor grader on a lever machine and the ergonomics were great. Definitely big improvement with the gear select. The seat's very comfortable. Air adjust is great. Lumbar support was really nice. The ease of pulling the console down to you and setting your steering wheel angle is, is, is a very nice option. Comparing the cab noise to previous models, this machine is, is great. Great. It's quiet. The HVAC system keeps you cool, keeps you warm. Stereo is great. No hydraulic whine really. The, the machine's comfortable to operate. The 16GC motor grader is simple, effective, reliable, and durable. From the push block to the mold board to the ripper carriage, this machine is very robust and easy to operate.